Yo, what's up, everyone? This is Val Ramos, and today's DJ tutorial on the CDJ3000s, I'm going to discuss the one piece of equipment that is the most critical piece of equipment that very few either fail to mention or that very few actually know about or discuss, but is very important for the overall establishment of a CDJ3000s with a DJM900 Nexus 2 mixer, and that is an Ethernet switch. So an ethernet switch is a powered device. You can see that there's a power button right here, but this piece is actually the most critical piece of this overall operation because this yellow cable goes into the mixer, the black cables, which came with the CDJ 3000s, those go into the link ports on the back of the CDJ 3000. So you can have a link port back there for ethernet cables and also here. And what this powered ethernet switch does is when you connect a thumb drive with one CDJ3000, it allows your other CDJ3000 or deck to read the same music. So it's very important because otherwise without this switch, you would have to have one thumb drive here and then another thumb drive here with the same or different music so you can play. With this ethernet switch, you can connect the two with just one thumb drive. So it's very critical, it's very important, but I'd recommend you get a four or eight port ethernet switch. I have this eight port ethernet switch called a TP-Link. Usually these switches will cost you roughly $20. You may need to buy an extra ethernet cable to connect to the mixer itself because you will only receive two black ethernet cables with the CDJ3000 and none with the actual Nexus mixer or DJM900 Nexus mixer. So a lot of people will have these cables in their house if they have computer automations, other electronics. So maybe you already have this piece of equipment, but you may need to buy not only the router itself with the power cable, the little power cable is organic to the actual ethernet switch, but you need to buy an extra ethernet cable to connect this overall system. So I know this may seem complex, especially if you're not tech savvy or, or good with IT, but it's actually a really simple device. It's really just cables. So if you know how to connect DJ systems with cables such as auxiliary cables and XLR cables and RCA cables or, or digital cables, it's the same concept. You're just connecting, you're connecting sound or connecting digital files really through this ethernet switch and then it's allowing you to play on both decks. So most people do not discuss this. It is in the instruction manual, but it's not completely clear what you should buy. So this is the piece that I'd recommend that you get in addition to the CJ3000s. And then this should be on the floor or off to the side. So it's not necessarily on display, but a lot of club setups will have this to connect both CJ3000s or 2000s. So there you have it. That is the one piece of equipment that is extremely critical for establishing this overall system, two CDJs with a mixer. And without this system, you will not be able to appropriately play with one thumb drive and that is really the goal. You want to have one thumb drive and plug and play. So when you show up to your gig, you really just want to bring the thumb drive and then your personal headphones. That's a personal piece. And when you're going to club gigs or festival gigs, those are the two pieces of equipment you should be bringing on a standard rider. You should outline that you need to have this system present and then you just got to bring your music and your headphones in order to listen to music and the headphones. But there should be not only the system itself, but a microphone, for example. But this ethernet switch, if you're thinking about buying a system for home use, is something that you should not forget and that very few discuss or many people don't even know exists to help make this overall system run smoothly. So there you have it. If you have any other comments, questions, tips or tricks to share with the audience, then please leave those in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video. It's the